better? So much better. Wow. Um, all right. Hi, how are you doing? Hi, how are you? Fantastic. <laughs> so, this question is specific towards you. You can answer if you want. Um, <laughs> yeah. All right, then. In an yeah. earlier, in an earlier panel, uh, Mark Hillebrand talked about this whole scene, but I wanted to see how you felt about him being on your wife. <laughs> Son of a bitch. <laughs> hey, Jerry wants to go to take this one. Love it. <laughs> oh, love it. Oh, there's so many directions to go here. There's a lot of landmines, too. I'm just gonna park the car. He had big vision. So I don't I don't have y'all been to uh, Europe. Um, so Pontevino is is sparkling water, right? And in Italy they call it like sea gas for flat water or cone gas with gas or not gas. And so Mark in my in my phone is saved as cone gas. <laughs> so we're not gonna text or something. It'll be like text message from Cone Gas. Like, Who? Who's texting you? Like, oh, nobody. Oh, the green. The gassy friend is texting you. <laughs> uh, I think. I think to speak for Atlas and myself and Daniel and Color Green. Um, like what a cool, what a cool actor to work with. You know, I think. Uh, that was I, interject. That was. Uh, one of the best things that happened as far as this scenario goes because <clears throat> my wife thinks I have a professional job <laughs> and she thinks that I go to work and I, I, I do my work professionally and I'm serious and I take my craft seriously and that we you know we, we're really doing we're really doing some hard, hard work and we do rarely um, <laughs> But there, there is one person on our show that is a constant professional, and that's Mark Pellegrino. And so for my wife to come on the show, I was so happy that she got to work with Mark because it then, oh, wow, y'all work hard. It, it then <laughs> furthers the ruse that we are really professionals and we take our job seriously. So I won't even move about it. I, she couldn't have picked a better person to be paired up with. Um, I'm also, uh, I, I also love Mark uh, and his talent, and I'm fearful of his fists. So I'm cool just backing away from the whole situation at this point. Thank you. Morning, sunshine. What's up? Chance? Hey, hey, hey. Um. Well, great seeing you. It's been a long time. Uh, nice jacket there, Dean. Your hair, Sam, is magnificent. Is that a leave-in conditioner you have there? Hmm. Eventually. How are you? Hi. I wanted to say that, first off, I want to tell you that 
You're a lot more handsome in person. <laughs> so I'm really ugly on film. Semi <laughs> ugly in person. Yes. God, you know, yes. <laughs> I was like, he's not gonna hear it. But my question is, <laughs> on the show uh, of the females, do you think it would be a good romantic match for Lucy? I'm so excited. <laughs> She's mad at me. <laughs> so I think I should avoid that one. You say Abaddon? Abaddon. Sam. 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 They're all awesome. But they're, there's a character. Yes. Like <laughs> coming around. Mary. 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 Is that a spoiler? <laughs> no, not her. Just kidding. Sorry. Um, there is a character. Sam. Sam. You guys keep pushing Lucifer. me on Sam. Sam. Lucifer. Why? Sam. Because they're shippers. Hey, I'm for it. Lucy's up for anything. <laughs> but there is a character. Danielle. 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 Danielle, not Danielle. Wait, what? <laughs> Guys. So I think there is a, a possible character coming that will open. Lucifer's heart. What? Is it heart. Sam? You're an angel. Back at you. Lucifer. What? No. Eek! No spare me, Dark Master? No quaking fear? Should I quake? I mean, yeah, most people sort of do, yeah. I'm not most. Right. Oh, people went, oh. <laughs> Did I hear oh? Yes. Did I hear a groan? Yes. Because you don't want this to have a heartbeat. You don't have one. You don't want him to be vulnerable, do you? No. You don't want him to be like a, 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 a chocolate chip cookie hard on the outside and soft and gooey on the inside, do you? <laughs> well, maybe he is. <laughs> Just saying. Maybe he is a chocolate chip cookie. <laughs> I like the chocolate chip cookie, Lucifer. <laughs> you do too? Yeah. Okay, stay tuned. <laughs> I'm not saying that's gonna happen. <laughs> because I like teasing you guys. And I feel bad about it. <laughs> But I like pretending things are going to happen and then they don't. <laughs> and then pretending like things aren't going to happen and they do. That's evil, isn't it? Yes! I don't mean to toy with your emotions. Yes, you do. Well, you're losing her. You're losing her. Scariest monster or creature? Yeah. Hmm. Yes. <laughs> uh, I'm going to go with Lucifer. Uh, Which is for Casper, Sanford? <laughs> <laughs> you know, the one you know. He is, uh, he's, he's so good and so scary, and, and uh, he's, very, he's very intimidating uh, when working with him. Punch you in the face, you quickly re 
remember that he's a trained boxer and he's trained and has been trained for many, many, many years to connect with his target. <laughs> I died a little that day. <laughs> I lost a few years of my life. And, uh, and, and I haven't been truly scared like that I don't, since I don't know when. So uh, I'm gonna go with Mark Pelican. Oh, I could do this all day. You make such funny noises. <laughs> What? You're awesome. <laughs> Thanks. Um, you too, I guess. <laughs>